What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Britannia Garden of Glass. This is episode 47, and in today's episode, we are going to be having a much better episode than last episode. Last episode, everything fell apart. Everything, almost quite literally, <laughs> uh, ended. So, we managed to recover the world. Everything's fine. Uh, we kind of got set back a little bit, but we are going to fix that stuff up today. We're going to be doing things that I didn't think we could do. But I may have figured him out. <laughs> and yeah, just a bunch of stuff, a bunch of things. Uh, let's get to it. So first of all, go on to that. Jump down. Where are we going to jump down? Let's jump down over here. Perfect. <laughs> uh, so what are we going to do? Let's have a look. Did I put that in there? No, I haven't. So we've got a bunch of mana here. We can maybe just drop this in here. Let it gather up a bunch of mana and keep going. So one thing that I had, well, we had an issue with last time uh, was this. By the way, you can see I've bred up some cows. This took, this was, you better appreciate how hard this was to do. That was a pain to get those cows to just breed. I actually haven't finished off cleaning that area up, so maybe we can just clean that up. Those, that wasn't part of it. It didn't work. My first idea didn't work. So we could just do that. Do I have any, oh, one mana glass, one piece of mana glass. We just do this and do this. We can get that started. Oh man, I don't have everything as per usual. Now, Remember I said we were having these issues here and I was getting really annoyed, really, really annoyed, but I figured them out. We have got ourselves melon seeds working again. We have got ourselves the ability to get this working again. Well, for the, from the beginning, you know what the issue was? You see how I chose magenta and magenta is great, but it looks a lot like purple. And in fact, when you do type in powder and you take the purple one instead of the magenta one, no wonder it doesn't work <laughs> with the magenta and purple sparks. But that is working. That is fine. Everything's going good here, it looks like. And yeah, that's good. That's good. So, solution to the problem. Now, around here, this is still off. Everything seems to be going all right, except for around here. I've been messing around, trying to work it out. I just don't know what's happening here. Every now and then, this farm just kind of lags a little bit, and it doesn't work the way it should. So, um, I, I have to figure that out. It's really, really weird. I think, you know what the thing is, we've just got so much stuff going on here. Maybe that could be an issue. Although this, I mean, this, it should work. It should work. Um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's all I'm going to see. You can see we've got all these filled up completely. Um, except for the orange, which is one, which should still work. So we we'll, might give that a go later on in the episode. That's not in the plan, though. Uh, rain, go away. <laughs> so yeah, what we're going to do next is we're going to get this farm up and running. That should be quick. I think we just have to connect it up to the corporea over there. And we can also jump down here. Let's let's do something, some bauble stuff. Bam. Down here. Got one of these. Now, what I've decided to do was I have got ourselves um, our thing here. Do, where is our Manasseo mon Monocle? Is it on there? No. Okay. What did I do with my Manasseo Monocle? <laughs> do we have it? It's not like it's on us. Let's quickly check this out. I was going to gonna do something cool so go around here will we see the range of these flowers no what did i do with it okay well that kind of didn't start off too well what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna find it and i'll be back okay so i couldn't find it and what we're gonna do is we're just gonna make a new one so i'm waiting for that to fill up then we'll get it but i forgot to show you what i fixed up from last episode so this is the way this whole mana glass farm is working we can just take these out and let it keep going so it's still gonna be doing that whole uh, piston thing. I've got that to work. And what I've done is I've just put a dropper over here because that's an immo immovable object so that it can't push these blocks through here. So when it does fill up, the last one will break, drop down, and go around that, like, the piston will just close up and stop this from working. We'll still have this kind of going out. I don't really care. It's not that much mana to lose. And really, we've got enough mana coming through right now, so <laughs> I'm not going to concern us with that too much. Um, in here, however, this does still lose a bit of cobblestone every now and then and uh, well majority of the cobblestone actually does still get lost but it's not a problem it would have been happening there and i just wouldn't have been realizing it and we've got more than enough cobblestone you can hear it's still kind of going all right and as i say that it stops <laughs> okay well that's that there we could grab this over here did i grab it i didn't grab it so what we can do is we can go hope to get some gold sometime soon in here uh, if not, that's not a big deal, but yeah, we're gonna have to wait so we can get ourselves a Manasseo Monocle. Uh, oh, what am I trying to do? Pop that into there. No. There. No. Why? <laughs> Just can't get this right, can we? So, you know, I've played so much Britannia, 
And to this day, you never get that right. There we go. That's loud. Get the hell away from there. <laughs> uh, well, that is on the cards. We can also maybe hope for the best while we wait for that and have a look. I had these things out two seconds ago. So we'll go down here, drop down, and search for our mana shears. Mana steel shears. There we go. So what I want to do now is I want to grab ourselves up some leaves, some of these particular beautiful bifrost leaves. So we get iridescent leaves. We need eight of these. And in fact, this is all because I, I'm, I'm, I'm in trouble. <laughs> I'm in trouble. Uh, a few episodes ago, I mispronounced fabulous. And that was because I thought I read it mispronounced, uh, misspelt. Turns out it was spelled perfectly fine. And I am me. So I have been told to fix up my fabulousness uh, by using, making one of these. Let's, let's just go here. We'll go, um, ooh, let's just do fab. So we'll just, we'll just say fab from now on. So there we go. Fabulous shield. And that's a botanical add-ons item. And I'm going to have to fix up my fabulousness with one of these. And yes, <laughs> uh, we are going to make one right now. Surprise, surprise. So what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to do that. Go up here and make ourselves one of these. We're going to... The punishment is to wear it for one episode, but I'm sure the punishment won't be too bad. So, uh, we might end up leaving it. Let's see how it goes. So, come on. There we go. And also, I want to try something out with, the, out with this, because I never knew until last episode that you can combine, um, uh, different baubles together. And I'm, I'm, I'll be interested to see whether or not you can combine this bauble with something. So, is this a ring slot one, or? Um, where is it? Take, take my... My stuff off. There we go. There we go. There we go. Does that come on over there? Oh, it's on the back. Uh, maybe. Okay, there we go. That's cool. <laughs> uh, so it ends up combining with where my wings would go. So we just do that, that, that. Where did my wings go? They get picked up here. I really don't want to lose my... Where did my... Oh, man. <laughs> there we go. Uh, okay, so it kind of glows, and then it comes down again. That's cool. I think my shirt might hide it. Yeah, that's annoying. I can always do this. This. Do that. There. And that. There. <laughs> do that. That looks funny. I look... I feel so weird. Like that. <laughs> Leave the boots. Leave the boots. Okay, now we can hope we can. We have got some of that gold. So go around here, check it out. That's loud. Oh man, that's loud. Not that lucky. Tell you what, we'll do this. Oh, we've got gold in here. What's my problem? What's the problem then? No. You need to go in there. We'll grab that one out. I apologize for your ears. Okay, that's fine. Go away from that. We don't need that. <laughs> we don't need that. Okay, so... Oh, man. Leave me alone. Oh, I don't have my wings. I'm trying to fly here. And I don't have wings. So, there we go. Like that. What is the recipes? It's something like that and... That and... That. Oh, yeah. Uh, now, the next thing I wanted to do was... We've got... Remember last time we tried to make it invisible and I didn't want to go invisible. So what my plan was, was to perhaps maybe phantom ink it like that. Maybe, no, no, no. Let's not do that. I, I want to try something else because I'm sure this will work better than doing it that way. We, where did it go? Did I pick it up? So what we'll do is we'll connect it onto our, maybe the ring of magnetization, which I don't have on me. I do have on me. I do. I lied. Can we not connect it? Oh, I've already, have I already done that? No, I haven't. Okay, so we can't connect it to that. Um, oh, I did connect it. I did. <laughs> Look at that. Um, so it turns out I did do that. There we go. And what my plan is, is maybe to do something like this. I knew I had the idea of it. I can't make that invisible. Darn it. So we found our, <laughs> our thing. Uh, can we combine these? No. Can we combine these? Yeah. Okay, we've got wings and we've got our shield. 
And the wings actually shouldn't be invisible right now. So let's check that out. Okay, it looks like I'm flying with a shield. That's great. That's actually pretty good. Um, now we just need to find out a way of connecting this to something. Does it connect to that? Yep, that's perfect. Um, I don't know why it's coming up with a weird square. Hello. <laughs> uh, we can do this. This should surely work. No. It doesn't want to tinge. Dang it. Okay, well, well, does it come around here with the uh, thing as well? Yeah, you can see it in the front of my face. <laughs> all right so let's get to, let's get to business here guys actually i'll just press f7 that's not doing anything to it no okay great well that was a bit of a detour uh what i'm gonna do now is i'm gonna try and connect this farm up and i'll give you an update as to what has happened so i'm pretty sure we'll get this to work who knows i might be eating those words but yeah i'll be back Okay guys, now what we are going to do is we're going to test that out. I've tried out a few things and I've just got something funny to show you here. What the hell is that pig doing? <laughs> oh man, that's... Oh, he must have come from the stairs. Look how smart that pig is. Walks upstairs and everything. And downstairs, obviously. But <laughs> that's not what we are here for. What we are here for is to test out whether or not this is close enough. So we'll pop one of these in there. And if it goes... It works. That is beautiful. Now we have to just test this one out so we can do something like so. And if we do that, it does go in there. Beautiful. That's easy. That's good. Now we need to just connect a bit of mana over here, which we've got this right around here. We could connect it up to there. In fact, this may just be in range. No. Oh, man. That would have been close. It would be very close. Definitely not in range. Uh, that's all right. We can do something. We don't have that. No, we can't do that, can we? Darn it. <laughs> uh, we can maybe do this over here with one of these. Perfect. Wow. Finally, I've got something in my inventory that I need, which is not enough. Gosh, darn it. Well, this will actually be making its own mana to feed that. So that's all right. We've got a solution. We've got solutions to our problems. Uh, I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> I had a bit, of a, a bit of trouble with the steak. But that seems to be working, hopefully now. So there we go. We've got steak there. We've got this over here. We're also going to need to make ourselves one of these mana, um, the ho hovering hourglasses to put in there. And we're going to have to just time that so that it sets up with that farm there. We've also moved these closer to each other so we can have that one in between the two of these. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go around here and hopefully we can start these cows breeding up again. And do we have enough? You know what? Oh, I was going to say, if we don't have any wheat, I will be very, very upset. Uh, but there we go. We do have some wheat. And I think we can place this just down there. There we go. Look at that immediately. <laughs> I've actually got no idea how many are in here. Let's let's see the... And see, quite a few. Quite a few. We should hopefully get some babies coming through the bottom here. Um, they should pop down. Maybe we've got too many. So what? We'll leave these guys for a little bit. Oh, there's some babies. There's some babies. They'll eventually just glitch through. They just pop and pop, and eventually it'll come through. Unless that, or maybe we'll see if it dies. <laughs> uh, why, why not laugh? All right, so what we'll do, we'll, we'll wait, see what happens, come back in a little bit, and hope for the best. All right, it has been some time. <laughs> I, I figured out what the problem was there, and it's taken me quite a bit of time to kind of get these things to go again. We've just been waiting for cows to grow. But we're here. We're here now. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm, I'm really not looking forward to breeding cows anytime in the near future. What the problem was, was I had a few slabs which were in those four corners. Um, we can actually break these and get in there. We had a slab over... Oh, sorry, cow. Slab over there, slab over there, and slab over there, which meant these baby cows couldn't fall through. And now they're starting to come through. Um, interesting. Very interesting. I don't know how they're coming through already. Uh, but yeah, what we, what we need to do is we need to do this... And then we'll make sure these all come through a lot more. So now we should see a bunch of baby cows popping through, hopefully. Yes, we're seeing more. We're seeing some more. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's basically what happened there. And they were just getting stuck. But now that we've got this little piece here, this should be working. And in fact, we don't need to have this one around here. Which might even improve this efficiency a little bit more. Sorry, wait. I didn't mean to take you. Do we do that? There? And now we can just drop a bit of wheat there because I don't know why it stopped requesting. No, that is that is a problem. <laughs> uh, so get in there. So one, get eaten. 
Another one comes. Good. That's working again. Perfect. And one of you guys can have that. So there we go. Hopefully that does work for us. Um, these cows should just kind of stay there because they want to stay with their parents. Like so. And... Yeah, let's hope for the best. Let's hope these ones do last long enough. Um, as I say, I really don't want to deal with cows for a very long time. And let's see how many of the... How much this has grown. Why did I take that? Oh, that's why I took damage. I'm almost low. <laughs> completely low on that. Uh, let's see how this is going. Yep, taking some time. Taking quite a lot of time. <laughs> oh, that's cool. That's cool. We can... It's a big project. Well, being, waiting. Uh, now, what we'll do is... We'll quickly discuss what I've done in the meantime. Uh, being... Like, before this episode. Uh, you can see, we I went down there, and I was wondering, why are we not getting a lot of mana? And it turns out, we're going to need to kill a bunch of mobs down there. Because right around there, the light has kind of messed itself up since we fixed this whole world up. And a, a lot of the light just never reset itself. So all we have to do is go down there and kind of light uh, light one of these. Where, where? I don't have it on me. Uh, one of those... Um, Mana flashes next to it and just put it back, break it again if we really wanted to. We could just do that. And we should be able to get this light to kind of sort itself out. So hopefully there's not any more spots around there like that. Uh, that seems to be the most affected one. But yeah, that seems to be <laughs> an alright way to fix it. Now what's going on here? Everything is still continuing on. I took out a bit of uh, mana glass a bit earlier. That seems to be working fine. Perfect. Still going. It's taking its time. It must be very close. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to go do another project. It's actually going to be a bit different to what we've done recently. And that is we are going to be fixing up this flower area here. We're going to be putting a roof on this. Maybe doing a little bit of decorating stuff. Because we haven't done anything like that. We've been doing a bunch of functional things. But nothing that makes the base look a little bit prettier. So what we're going to do is we're going to gather up a bunch of botanical add-ons wood. We're going to gather up the same sort of colors. The blue being this infused. Is it um, infused wood? And also this magenta, because the magenta is just awesome. I love magenta. It's a great color. So, we'll be back. Okay, so I'm kind of just getting going here, seeing what we can do about this. I've got an idea. And um, the idea is basically to make these kind of look like petals coming out here. I don't want to go too far out, like, in weird depths or so. I want it to look kind of similar to, similar to that one there, but a bit more colorful. So, we're going to have, like, an opening flower in my mind that's what it's looking like although we don't know who knows what it's going to turn out like so i'm going to go up like this i'm going to try out just seeing how these things look uh we're probably going to have to cut down a few more infused wood trees and it's kind of annoying that i cut that down now but yeah that, that's kind of the idea now the next thing is around here this seems to be working i've got it on 30 seconds of time just so that i know whether or not this is keeping up uh and this seems to be going all right here so that's good. That's good. We're getting a little bit of mana there. It's only been running for about two minutes or so, so there's no surprise that there's not much there. We'll have to wait for these guys. These should all come in a big load of these. We're probably going to need to get more cows at some stage, but they can wait. <laughs> they can wait after today for me. Uh, so yeah, that's a little bit of an update. Okay, so next update. That is kind of the design that I was going for there, and I'm kind of liking how these things are sticking out like that. So I was just using them as filler blocks, but that's going to work quite well. We're definitely going to have to get some more of the infused wood, that's for sure. But that shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, that's that's good. It's good when things like this turn out good. <laughs> so I'm just going to keep going with this. Maybe we can get... I want to get a, a, the uh, petals into this at some stage. Because, I mean, this is the petal farm. And I've been waiting to use those blocks for quite some time now in terms of uh, just a decorating blocks. So that's, that's good. That's good to get that out of the way. Uh, as for the rest of the stuff, um, it's a matter of time to see what happens with that. Just to... Get the timing right, but it looks like we probably do have another mana producing thing in the base, which is great. We'll get we'll get our big uh, SS Terra Shatterer in no time. So, yep, that's what's happening. And as per usual, I'll give you another update. Okay, well, this is kind of coming out the way I wanted it to, so we just have to do a few things, and it's yeah, it's it's a little bit different, but still kind of on the right track. Uh, we'll go back now. And check it out. I just want to finish off this little piece here. That might be it. Let's have a look. Glad we made it. There we go. So that's not the end of it. But I kind of want it to look like that. We might make these petals go a little bit higher. As if it is a flower coming out. So we'll have to do that. That. We'll replace them with some of these. Is Why not? Why not? <laughs> 
Um, so yeah, that's that's kind of what's happening there. So we can do that. Go around here. Do that. Like that. And this should be very, very close to what we want. There we go. Check it out. You know what? I think it might not look the way I plan on it looking, but yeah, that's way too high. But it's gonna it's gonna be all right, and that's that's all that matters. It's just gonna be a bit better than what we've done before. It's gonna hopefully look a bit nicer. Um, I'm definitely gonna have to grab more leaves. And by the way, I was lucky. I found a bunch of these in a chest, so I didn't have to cut down that many trees in the end. So that that's great. Uh, now it's just a matter of finishing this off. It's looking a bit weird. I mean, hey, whatever, whatever. <laughs> See how it turns out. Alrighty, so I thought I'd give you an update. It's, it's really not looking anything like what I wanted it to look. Uh, but that is the way it goes, you know? Like, I don't know. <laughs> it's something. It's something different. It's a bit of bit of difference to the landscape, I guess. Sticks out around there. That's great. Yeah, we can, we can work on it. We can work on it over time. We might think of good ideas. Tell me any good ideas, please. <laughs> uh, so here we've got all these cows, and they don't seem to be dying quick enough. At all. And I don't understand why. I really don't. Uh, let's just have a look, see how this is going though. This should still be working. Yep, yeah, I saw that just eat it. Come on. Spit it out. Beautiful. So, I mean, it, it's producing some mana. We probably could speed it up. I don't know why those cows aren't dying, so let's just take a look at that. Let's have a look at the... Should be the bell thorn. Is that the bell thorn in there? It is. Um, we'll just go down here. And, oh man, this is annoying without the... Uh, what's his name? Magnet on. So let's just... Uh, no, no, that's not a good idea. <laughs> uh, so what we'll do is we'll just go under here and we'll need that there. This block. Um. Make sure we don't mess this up, because if I don't have enough flight, that'll be the end of me. So we have to go over one, two, three blocks with that there, in fact, because it's a, um, seal link, a sealed oak block. Please be underneath it. If not, this cow's fallen out. Yeah, Dreadthorn. Dreadthorn I need, or the Bellthorn I need? That's an interesting one. Let's go here. Let's go. Um, oh, we've got it here. Pretty sure it's the Dreadthorn, if I remember correctly. Uh, not generating... Red thorn, red thorn. Fast it. Um, dread thorn. Only hurt adult animals and no one else. Why are you not hurting it? anyone at all? <laughs> uh, maybe it'll just need to be put down and put picked back up again. So, will these cows be able to walk into that? I don't think so. No. If I remove that, I think we should still get them to walk into it. Also, let's just do a test and see if this is connected. Okay, it's not connected to a mana pool. There's our problem. Uh, it's connected to a mana pool, just without any mana. So why does this not have... Oh. Oh, look at this. <laughs> look at what I'm going to do. Bam. Please give me some mana. Tell you what. Um, I'm going to have to go clear out that area at the bottom there. Make sure we're getting some mana into this. Okay, I have forced mana in. And it seems to be working. <laughs> uh, we just got to make sure we don't back that mana up in there. And that should be all right. So... Now, let's look at that. Beautiful. In fact, we're probably going to have to put ourselves a hopper hock. Have we got any way of getting that at all? No. No, we haven't. <laughs> uh, so we're going to have to put a hopper hock down here. I'll just steal the one from next to the blaze. Because we're not going to be picking up any of that stuff any longer. It's not really necessary. We'll, we'll have to work out our shedding farm at another stage. But for now, we're just going to be using this one. Because, I mean, hey, I'm lazy. So, that can go around... Yeah, actually, where I had an item frame on me this whole time. This whole episode, actually. I've had an item frame bugging me in my inventory, not having any use at all. And now I need one. <laughs> uh, is it in here still? Yep, there's a few there. And we'll need to get some wheat to just kind of do something, which I actually did in the Hopper Hock tutorial i did mention this and this is something i've never actually used before which is the whitelisting and blacklisting feature um we've always whitelisted we've never blacklisted i think that's the the right correct correct way of doing this um so what we'll do is we'll just yeah steal that one does that not get a new one yes it does yes it does why is it not you know what 
Gonna have to do okay there we've got one there. Good. Work. Perfect. <laughs> uh so we're gonna have to probably do something like that and put one of those there. And then what we're gonna have to do is do actually. Yeah, we're gonna have to do it like that. So we're gonna have to go like that and go uh there. Pick up only items not in frames. Good. Do that. Put that in there. Now that should pick up everything that's not in a frame. So that's in a frame. It shouldn't pick it up. It should pick up the stuff which it has. And that's beautiful. That's beautiful. <laughs> uh, now I just need a way of getting all this experience. Can it come through there? No. Oh, well. Oh, well. Uh, well, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to keep tweaking this. And hopefully we will figure out the correct amount of time this, that this will need uh, to make the most mana. And then we're also going to have to hook this up, which is simple. I mean, it's a matter of doing what we've done here. Might be a bit weird, might be a bit different, but it'll be fun. So for now, guys, I think that's going to do it for today's episode. We have achieved quite a bit of weird things. Uh, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go kill some mobs. But aside from that, we've got that done. We've got that stuff. I'm pointing in the right direction. That stuff there done, which has been bugging me for quite some time. I'm sure a lot of you guys might have known that. Oh, man. <laughs> but yeah, thank you very much, guys. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.